Ho, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, and welcome. My name's Richard Ishwood. I'm a registered nurse, and my clinic's in the UK called No More Earwax. Um, interesting little case today. This chap came to see me with two blocked up ears who were struggling in this one, um, which was his uh, left one, sorry, more than, more than the other one. And the, sure, the blockage of earwax wasn't helping, um, but as we removed this really dark, um, dark black, it's jet black when it comes out, so it's obviously been there quite a long time, um, and as we removed it, it revealed another problem which certainly isn't helping. Um, why he's struggling to hear very well. So this fixed probably about half of the problem. It didn't fix the whole problem. And you'll see why when we pull this out, which it didn't come out without too much of an argument. Look at how black that is. It is jet black. Just got a little bit stuck on the outside there. Let's just go back in and fish that out. Hope she pops. And as you can see here, um, you can see at the bottom of the eardrum there, which is the silvery membrane at the back there, if you've not seen an eardrum before, you can see what looks like a collection of like straw coloured fluid um, at the bottom of the eardrum. Now you can get fluid behind your ear for a number of reasons. You can have a problem with the tube that drains it, which is called a eustachian tube, that goes to the back of the nose. Uh, that can become blocked and it acts as a natural drainage to allow the fluid to drain out. Um, sometimes infections and what have you can obviously cause that buildup of fluid. So I'll pass that on to the to the GP. In the meantime, there are uh, things you can try to drain that. Um, this thing called an otovent or an otovent balloon. Um, it's basically a balloon that you pop up, you know, shut one nostril and you inflate it. And then you, when it deflates, it forces air up there and forces that tube open, the eustachian tube, and allows all that fluid to drain out. So I've suggested to try that. Um, and hopefully that should help to clear that. It could hear a lot better after we got that big plug out, don't get me wrong, but hearing still wasn't still wasn't 100%, so I suggest that was probably the problem, was, was that fluid behind the eardrum there that was uh, causing that. Second ear, ear here, didn't really have a problem with the fluid behind the eardrum in this one, but obviously got a decent plug that needs to come out. This chap was actually a pub landlord, um, and I didn't actually know him, but as we got speaking about which is pub, I've been in his pub before, as I've been in a few, so I know I've known a few landlords in my time. Um, turns out he actually knew my dad, because my dad, I don't know if, you, if any of you watched my videos before, you'll know that my past career was a musician. One of the past jobs anyway, was a musician. And um, <clears throat> that obviously comes from my dad, who um, was in a, a rock band. Um, it still is, still carts his gear about at uh, the grand old age of <laughs> uh, playing his rock music. And yeah, he, this landlord had had my dad's band in there. And uh, yeah, they, they're very good. Um, oh, speaking of bands, there's a band. Um, I don't get paid to promote anybody else's stuff. I just thought I'd, I'd let you know. So it's a really small town where we're from, a town called Lee, which is in, um, in the northwest of England. And here in the UK, we, we, we don't get many um, famous acts or artists comes out of it. Um, there's one out at the moment called the Lottery Winners, and there's a very real chance that they might get uh, our town's very first UK um, number one album. So go and check them out. We actually met them uh, yesterday. Uh, lovely chaps and, and lady. Uh, they're really good. I suggest you go and, go and search them out um, on the internet. Just search for the Lottery Winners band. I promise you won't be disappointed. It's a really, really good album called uh, Anxiety Replacement Therapy. Like I said, I'm not sponsored. <laughs> they just, like I said, we don't get many famous bands coming from our town, none in fact. Um, I think Guy from the Buscox was actually from our band though. But yeah, we're trying, we're trying to get, get them to have our town's very first uh, number one album. So go and search out the lottery winners, guys. Um, now this, um, this plug, again, just like the other one, Jet Black. Here it pops. You can see how smooth it is. It's really filled up that air canal. As you can see here, can't see too much of an issue with any fluid there behind there and you could uh, hear a lot better uh, in that one but the other one we'll sort out with the treatment from his GP and this this balloon hopefully will sort that out anyway hope you enjoyed that little video for today uh, thanks for watching take care of yourselves I'll see you soon bye bye